Good afternoon. Check this out. The um, the old uh, ninety six fits on here. This this is not a Franken lathe because this lathe will have uh, all its own parts: headstock, uh, slide rest, tailstock, everything. And uh, I'm uh, really happy. The bolt holes lined up with the little feet there. Now, these little feet, <laughs> a little short. Blade sticks off about a foot further than the other one. And I will get a quarter inch plate and uh, drill three holes, bolt it on there, and it's probably going to weld onto this and over there to the uh, structure and uh, it's just going to be a support and I think this is going to work out good and the best part though is uh, my spindle <laughs> it's got all the threads it needs and that chuck will uh, <laughs> quit wobbling to fit on there the way it's supposed to but this is a little update. I wanted to show what I was doing. This is the old bed. I took it off, took the took the whole thing apart, one piece at a time. And uh, and that's the uh, the old head sock off the old three. Like I said, uh, all the parts will stay with the uh, appropriate lathes, and there's not not going to be uh, interchangement. But uh, I did get this done too. I've been. Uh, this is a. I, I put receivers here. This is a receiver. Two and a half inch. Uh, you can get two and a half inch, three sixteenths wall tubing. Now I did put. Uh, Weld a half inch nut here and here, so push down and push over, and it makes it solid. And uh, this one right here is going to be a. Uh, I'm going to put a. The uh, sundial. I have a sundial, and when I show out there, this little area out here is uh, to the uh, southwest, which in the afternoon will get the sun and uh, set it up and see if the uh, sundial actually keeps time which I'm sure it does it's, you know sundials are what thousands of years old should work so I got one there and, and here and, and uh, this is actually the piece right here that's gonna go it it, it has a uh, this piece down here is is two inch three sixteenths wall so that the inch and a half tubing will uh, fit in there like a receiver and I'll uh, uh, weld on some nuts this particular one only has one which I made a mistake should have one right here too to hold it in uh, two dimensions the XY uh, to really stiffen it up this one right here you you can't uh, stiffen it up. It, with only one, it moves around. Now over here, as you can see, I got one here and here because this uh, vise I put on here and I had it over here and the uh, x-axis was alright but the y would move. Now with it like this, it's on there really solid and these receivers are you know, I'm going to rate it at 500 pounds. And uh, so this one really, really works good. The, this is a vise that I purchased when I was very young, about 18 years old, this, back in the 60s. And this was the first, uh, uh, one of the first pieces of, of tools I ever got. And I still have it. And it's it. I believe it was made in Japan, 
and it's not a old American but um, it's my first one I still have it and is so it has some sentimental value to me uh, it won't go to the shows out there but I have this one which uh, if I can show you this one right here is an old American it was patented 1879 and I will mount this on a, a similar piece like this one and uh, you know show it for the kids and the families and stuff but um, just a little update oh yeah one other thing it's uh, got a lot lighter out here <laughs> I'll shine it up here. It kind of uh, lighting goes out, but but I put a another a couple more strings of light, 24 lights each, and uh, so now I have a a total of uh, of uh, I got five strings, 12 lights each, which makes it uh, I got 60 lights up here. These lights, these uh, put out quite a bit of light, and and I'll tell you, if anybody's interested, uh, you can get get the strings at Harbor Freight for with the 20% discount and the, everything for 19 19.95, and I go over to the dollar store and replace them with the LEDs, and they come with a 11 watt incandescent which is essentially a um, ambiance light so I replaced all the the uh, incandescent with with a uh, LED and this puts a lot of light out so when I go out to the shows and the Sun goes down and I flip my lights on and uh, I'm uh, lit up everything and uh, attract everybody in there. Well, anyway, if uh, you have a comment or you like it, let me know. Thanks. Bye.